Hey, what's going on, Facebook? This is Laid Back Black here, trying to help you guys out putting on uh, installing MAME on your um on your iPad. I've got the iPad 10.5 Pro, but I'm gonna show you what software I've been running. Uh let me see, how do I go to here to show you the software? Um I've been on if you look here. My software is da, 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 where is it? Eleven point right there. Eleven. I don't know if you can see that eleven point four one right there. All right. So I'm on eleven point four point one, and um, what I'm gonna do? What you need to do first of all is go to Safari and click on Cyrus. Type in Cyrus Hub. What can you see it on here? Let me see. Yeah, Cyrus Hub up there, up there at the top. I'm trying to zoom in. Well, okay, there you go, Cyrus Hub. So you type in Cyrus Hub. Once you get the Cyrus Hub, um, you type in um, inst right here. You'll see install. Click on that install hub and hit allow. And there it is. Install. Put in your passcode and whatever. Okay. Well, I've already got it, so I don't have to, but you know, hit the install, so forth. So once you get on the Cyrus Hub, you can go, it'll install it, and it'll put, uh, where is it? That's Tweetbox. I might have to put this bad boy back in here because uh, I think I might have messed up. Okay, well, anyway, you know, big deal. I go back on the Safari, install Cyrus Hub, allow, uh, install, and I put my passcode in. There you go. And then hit, hit the install button again. Install profile. There it is. It's done. Now... I can go out here to the main screen and there it is right here Cyrus Hub so when I go over to Cyrus Hub I go over here oh, let me back up a little bit I got so much stuff on this table sorry about that y'all work with me And no, hey, when you see these things pop up on here, there's an X up here in the top left corner. Hit the X. Do not hit yes on these things. Hit the X button. Hit X again. And it got congratulations. Crap. I don't want it. Okay. So now we go down here to emulators. You see all the stuff you got. You got entertainment, social media, blah, blah. I'm in the emulators. I'm not in all that social media. I bought my iPad for uh, entertainment. Um so you see what all you have on here. You've got um, you got Commodore 64. You got Game Boy Advance. Uh, you've got uh, Happy Chick. I don't mess with that. So the one I'm looking for, you even got PP uh, the PPS the Place PSP and uh, RetroArch, which has been hard to get one that's working. So here's the main for iOS that I like. I clicked on that and. Um, I'm going to try to find a one that has it that download. You can go to tweak box or ignition and I click on, I'm clicking on ignition, hit install. If you want to see how it's turning out, you can go out to the main screen and see it downloading it. Oh, this computer's got a backup, man. I'm trying to do this with a laptop. You know, this is, my, this is one of my first videos trying to explain how to do something. So, you know, you guys work with me. I'm trying to help some people out that really like games uh, like I do old school retro games. Uh, you know, I grew up on this stuff. All right, there we go. So you see the main for, main for iOS pop up. I click on it. Okay, no games found. After installing, place your main titled zip roms in this folder well you don't even have to do any of this man i'm gonna show you how to do this bad boy and you do not have to do it um this is what you do okay i gotta sit my sit, sit the tablet right here back my computer up over here get my cord out okay this is what i want to do um 
you got iTunes on your if you have if you have iTunes, of course everyone does. Should um I'll hook this cord up and slide this over. All you have to do is just drop the ROMs. And I'm gonna tell you the place to go get the ROMs at also. I've got them saved on the I've got them saved on the computer. So this is what I'm gonna do. Uh I'm gonna open up my I'll be quiet. Um well open up my file for um just open. Just close you. you minimize you. I don't need you right now. Um Okay, um like I'm going into the MIDI music. It's really no music in here. Oh yeah, I do have some MIDI files. I'm trying to learn how to play the keyboard. But anyway, I'm going down here to um a folder. Um don't close. Um, a folder that I have here, Funbox, and I'm gonna click on this right here. This is this is my uh, external uh, disk that I've got. The website where you can go get these ROMs at. I, I couldn't remember it right offhand. So the um, the ROMs can be found. Come on, baby. That's the wrong one. I'm sorry. ROMs can be found, and let me go to main for iOS. That's where I have it at. Okay, now I scroll down. These are all the ROMs that I have. I saved them already. But if you go here to these websites right here, uh, one of them is called uh, Worms. Oh, let me put it up here for you. I'm going to zoom in so you can see that website right there. That top one with the... Uh, what is that? Wildworms.com slash go to that spot right there, man. And that has all the ROMs. Now, check this out. For you guys that have a cell phone that has the main for uh main for Android, these are the same uh ROMs. You can put this on your Android tablet. You can put it on uh, you can put the same all these ROMs will run on your Android tablet, your Android phone, your iPhone, and your iPad. So uh yeah, go to that site right there. Uh and also if you also want an alternative to you know what I told you guys about with um with right here, with this with this place right here, where is it? With um Cyrus, what is it? Cyrus Hub. Here's an alternative site too. Click on, uh, type in, uh, go in your Safari and type in www.tweetbox.app. But anyway, so once you go to that site, and um, I guess I'll copy this and show you what the site looks like. Good grief, what did I just do? Um, Yeah, let me copy this right quick. Okay, now I'm going to go on here and can you see what I'm doing? Okay. You guys, uh, forgive me. You know, I'll get better as time goes on. But uh, I'm pretty sure you can put up with this for a little bit just to get what you want. So, uh, bear with me for a second. Okay. Now, this is the site that we're going to, that worms, that wild worms. And see, here are all the games. You just, they're in alphabetical order. And what you do is you download them. And if I was you, if, if I were you, I'd just download all of them at one time. That's what I did. I downloaded them all at one time, put them in one folder, the ones that I really wanted, the games that I wanted. You know, I've got 200 and... Uh, what what is this? Uh, I think I got I got over two hundred gigs of free space. So so um, I can just I've got plenty of room. Okay, so when you download them, I put them in a, I put them in that file like I told you. And this is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to put these bad boys in now. Okay, so I showed you those sites. Okay, now all these ROMs. I'm really getting tired of this. Yeah. I've got to take this uh, bad boy out right quick because it's, it's going to be in the way. Let's 
slide it on out. Okay. And del well, I'm going to have to delete it. That's what I'm going to have to do. Because I already know where they're at. Delete. You don't have to do this. I'm just deleting it because I don't need it. I was just trying to show it for reference for you guys. Okay. So anyway, this is what we're going to do. Now, once you have everything, you know, your ROMs all in this folder, all these ROMs you see right here, this is what you do. You go to iTunes. Like I'm going to click on my my pad and then go to file sharing. Okay. Now, once you go to file sharing, you see that main, let me zoom in for you right quick. That main right here, this main 64, just click on it and you'll see all of the, um, all, you know, the, the, it just tells you the files that are in there. You don't have to take your ROMs and Actually, go in there and drop them into the um, into the uh, ROMs category right there, the ROMs folder. You don't have to do that. All you do is take these files. Watch this. I'm gonna not minimize, but I'm gonna make this a little smaller so I can pull those files that I told you all the ROMs, and I'm gonna I'm gonna get them all. I'm gonna select them all, and watch what I do. Let's go to the top. This is my son's computer. I do not like this thing. Um, okay, well, let's see. Now, I know it's a better way to do this. I'm gonna select them all and watch this. I'm gonna take them and drop them in that, drop them right there in this, just in here. Just take them. Oh, give me one second, I'm sorry, I messed up again. I got to get better with this thing. My fingers are not working today. Okay. Select them all. Okay. See how I select them now? Drag them and drop them in there. See where? And see how it says link? Just drop them. Now, if you look up top, you'll see it's putting them in there. So, you know, let me cut my computer back. I'll cut my... Uh, Cut this back on. <laughs> okay, it's copying them, it's copying them, it's copying them. Now, also it wouldn't hurt if you went on and tried to, I'm, I'm you know, I've got this game vice controller. And on my Game Vice controller, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna put it up here for you guys. I love the Game Vice controller for me. You know, uh, most I, most most handhelds are too small for me to really, you know. I'm 50 years old. I like my games, but you know, most most iPads are just. I mean, most handhelds are just too small. I could put my big old iPad in here and really feel like I got an arcade. In my hand, when you're somewhere chilling, man, and waiting on people, I'm a truck driver, so I'm sitting out waiting on people to show up. Some a lot of times, and I have nothing to do, so I get my iPad out and I put it in here and play games with it. Okay, so check this out. There, if if you can get rooted, it might be a good idea, unless you can find this right here. Now I'm gonna show you something. This is what I had to have for this. The seems like it's the only way it's gonna work with. Um, with with this it, it works with it um when you're getting stuff off of the uh itunes site games that work with it but but if you're doing stuff like what we're doing uh rom, um roms and so forth i had to go to this right here let me find it it's called controller for all i think that's what it's up under um let's see let's see i'm trying to see do i have it well, apparently not. It, it works, so don't worry about it. It, it. it must work with without me having to have it, so no big deal. Because I don't, I don't see it on here. Controllers for all. Because first of all, I haven't turned. If you look, if I haven't turned on my my um, what you call it? See, my city is not coming up, so I've got to get it activated. But anyway, 
um, I click on this electric electrical right there and it'll come up. But anyway, okay, so they're all finished. Now, check this out. When we click on main now, I'm going to click on main and uh, tell it to reload. There it is. It's reloading them. Bam. There you go, baby. I got all them bad boys on there. All these games. It's a total 85 that I put on here. Uh, how many of you guys know? Uh, let's let's take a look at Street Fighter. Uh, Street Fighter EX Plus. Now that's a good looking game, and and that really pushes it. Show you how strong this system is. So you click on that. And, you know, I I'm, I would hook my joystick up to the. Um, I don't need this anymore. I can unplug it. Uh, but you know, if you don't have a controller. You can use this external controller on here, but uh, you know, like I said, I got my game vice. There you go. Capcom. Capcom, baby. Arika. Man, we come a long way, man. I remember going to the arcades, spending a lot of money. Round one, fight. I never would have thought we could play stuff like this at home. Now, this also keeps your high scores too. Um, I'm gonna give you some. I'm gonna give you guys a little couple of hints. You go to options, click on settings. Uh, as you see here, peer to peer net play. You got your buddies around. You can play. You know, I've never tried it. I, I don't know too many people, you know, but hey, um, too many people that I could play with. But game input. Um, there you go. Digital stick. Uh, if you have an external controller, you click on it. You put in the uh, arcade or the uh, whatever ones you have. I've got none on here because um of of my uh game pad my game my what is this game a uh, game vice controller the game vice controller but um let's take a look at some other things that you might want to do with this thing um i keep mine on full screen i like the full screen now keep aspect keep aspect ratio you know you could take that off and that'll keep it full screen at all times but uh, I keep that on. I keep it on just like the arcade. Uh, you know, some games that didn't take up the whole screen. That's what that is for. You can m keep, uh, you can turn that keep aspect ratio off on both of these. It's one here and one here. You cut both of those off and it'll be full screen for every game that you play. You know, cause some games that you play, um, uh, are not fully full screen. So, um, you got your emulation speed. Um, I'm trying to make sure I'm not forgetting to tell you anything and how to do this. Um, but I think that's it. Uh, Sideline effects. Okay. All right. So um, you hit done. Yeah, out of there. Um, now, I'm going to tell you what. One more thing. When it comes to... When it comes to uh, setting up, setting up your controller, hit exit, and like you want to set up the controllers for um, this game right here. What I do is um, I go down here to configure. You see at the bottom. See right down at the very bottom it says configure controller. These little controllers kind of tricky, but hit the B button and user interface. And uh, you can click in that, 
you know, um, matter of fact, go back out of there. That's not the, that's not a good one. Um, click on uh, player one controller. There you go. And then that way you can, if you have an external controller or, or, or this controller right here, that's on the screen, you can tell it what all you want it to do. Um, you know, you click on the button and bam, do it like that. But, uh, I don't need that. But um, there, there was one more thing that I needed to tell you. I just thought about it. Um, let's click on the game again. Um, King of the Fighters, of course, you got on here. That is what I'm trying to see. Total Carnage, yeah. Um, once I get a game going, let's see. Okay. Huh. This one don't work, so I gotta find I gotta take that out of there. I'm glad I saw that that King of the Fight is not working. So let's go to this total carnage. Push the joystick, bam. You just move the joystick and tap buttons and so forth and that'll get things going. <sighs> the thing that you've got that you might wanna do oh man, I hope I didn't forget this again. Okay, oh option. Go to settings, and when you go down to, where is it, what is it, what is it? You know what, man, I'm, I'm really upset with myself because I get so much stuff going through my mind, I can't remember. Was it the game filter? Hide none working, you can take that off, um, which ones you don't want working, game input. We saw that. Um, well, I'm sorry. Um, you guys forgive me. But that's pretty much it. You you see what you got to do. Um, it was something that was on my mind, and now I can't think of it. Uh, but that's how you put all these games on here. You don't have to go through all the, heart, the headaches of uh, trying to get something like FileZilla to open up and individually put these in, you know, you can just drop them all in that one, drop them all right there. And, uh, you're in there. So, man, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give me a thumbs up, man. Um, uh, you know, Hey, video gamers, we supposed to stick together, enjoy ourselves and, you know, keep this thing going. Cause, um, you know, Hey, this is what we do. <laughs> hey, so, uh, let's just take a look at total carnage right quick. That was pretty fun back in the day. Put a lot of quarters in on this one. And you know, my grandkids think I'm the coolest granddad in the world. Got all, got all these video games and you know, don't let people tell you oh, all yeah, that's, that's kids stuff. You know, you're too old for all that, man. Enjoy yourself. Life is short. You know, uh, if it brings you and your family, your, your grandkids, your kids closer together, you get to reminisce over some things, man, please. I'm going to enjoy myself. Uh, I'm not going to let nobody judge me. Well, people can't judge you, but I'm not going to let nobody make me feel bad about what I take entertainment in. Uh, every man has his toy. So, hey, you guys have a good one. And I um, uh, hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day. Peace.